Alright guys, let me quickly show you how to rename your files before submitting them. When you rename your files, you make the approval process very easy and this will save me a whole lot of time. Right now on my system, I'm going to open two folders and the first folder is on the left, which is the one I have here. You see there are some files there and all of the files are already renamed. If you are looking for individual file in this folder, you can easily locate it without having to open all the files in the folder. For example, if I want to see FST222, Food Engineering Past Questions 2017-18, I can easily go ahead and click on that without having to open all the files in the folder. As you can see, this is the exact cause and I have named it properly and that makes it easy for me to see that particular cause without having to open all the files in the folder. However, let's go ahead and see the second folder to the right. As you can see in these folders, we have some files. All of the files are not named. The first file here, I don't even know what it is and what the cause is. So if I want to look for a particular cause in this particular folder, it will become very difficult for me and I will have to open all the files in the folder. I don't want to do that. So I want to be able to identify a particular cause in this folder and that is why you need to rename all the files before you submit them. If I go ahead and open this first one, you see the first one is from Department of Urban and Regional Planning, Faculty of Environmental Sciences, Laduke Akintola University of Technology, Obumosho, and the course title is Urban and Regional Planning Laws and the course code is URP413. Now, Without me opening this file, I will not be able to know the course code and the course title and I will not be able to know the year. Although there is no section mentioned in this particular past question, however, for most of the past questions, you will see the section stated in the past question. So what I want to do now is to rename this file so that I can easily locate it at any time. I will go ahead and open a notepad so that I can see this and name it at the same time. URP413 urban and regional planning laws. If the year is stated in this particular past question, I can go ahead and add it to the front, let's say 2016 slash 2017. So I can copy this name and go ahead and rename the file I want to rename. I click on the particular file I want to rename, I right click and I go straight to rename. Now I paste the name in this particular space and I click save. Now I can easily locate URP413 Urban Regional Planning Laws in this particular folder. I don't have to look at every file in this folder before I can know the exact file I'm looking for. Renaming the files make it easy for me to approve and it also save me a lot of time. I believe you know how to rename your files now. Go ahead and rename all your files before submitting them so that I can quickly verify them and approve your submission. Thanks for watching the video and if you have some questions, feel free to ask and I will definitely respond to every single question. Bye for now.